this look is a little bit of a spoiler alert spoiler alert so the other day i was pondering and thinking about 2014 era morning routines how like morning routines and get ready with me's have changed over the years for better or for worse these morning routines they were so colorful and bright and fun copyrighted music they didn't care they didn't care it was copyrighted music. five sauce music like super popular music at the time that i would not dare touch not dare drag into my editing software ever something magical is there a lot of them are not realistic at all and i don't think they were trying to be super realistic and that's kind of why i love them because now we've kind of gone on the other side where like everything's super realistic and i feel like the queen of this was bethany moda i will leave some in the description below just a few of my faves from 2014 and you can kind of compare it to this because i wanted to do my own version of it but i just wanted to do this little intro so because they did <laughs> rock paper scissors shoot oh man anyway <laughs> let's get into my morning routine that I definitely filmed super early this morning, as you will see. It's time to wake up, Mads. <gasps> I'm awake. Wow. See, like, sometimes I just love the morning so much I just laugh. A little stretch. <sighs> just breathe in that morning air. Take my time before picking up my phone. Oh. <laughs> Looks like I got a text. Oh. Oh no, it doesn't look like a good text. Okay, oh, I have that response ready for him. I've got the response. Okay, Ooh. maybe I don't wanna say that. No, that's too rude. Okay, and send. Okay, turn that phone off, girly. It's such a beautiful morning. <laughs> Time to get out of bed. <laughs> Oh, always make your bed every single morning. It just takes me about three seconds because I sleep like an angel. Then I come into my bathroom to brush those pearly, pearly whites. And I use my Quip toothbrush, <laughs> sponsored. Actually, no, it's not, it's not, it's not, it's not, it's not. And then I use Crest Gum Detoxifying toothpaste because it detoxifies your gums as I have heard it say and I brush my teeth for two minutes two exactly this toothbrush actually has a timer on it so you know that it's exactly two minutes and there you know, I'm to you then yeah that's what I was saying so, beautiful all right I think it's time for breakfast people so my go-to brekkie is a scramby eggs and um, some toast. I love a good breakfast. There we got the butter going on there. Yep, gotta have the butter. And then pour those scrambies in there. And that's how I scramble eggs. It's probably wrong, but it's the simplest way for me. So put up my cute little plate and put a little bit of salt and pepper on there and a hey 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 gotta have a little dance and I had an old bun that well it's not old it's just I had it left over and so I'm gonna use that for the toast and it actually I actually like that sometimes better than just regular bread and it's hot it's hot to touch but I always try to get it out with my fingers so I gotta use a paper towel um, and sometimes I warm up my butter knife on the bread, like women in STEM actually. Gotta spread some butter on there. And use some Smucker's strawberry jam. Yum, that close up though. And I go over and sit and have my girl breakfast, girl breakfast. <laughs> I look like I'm about to eat that up, which is very true. That's what I'm doing. It's good. It's very good. Yes. Yes. 
Um, uh, but wait, this is missing something. <laughs> it's not complete without some coffee. <laughs> Today I'm making a pot of coffee. Sometimes I'll use my Keurig, but lately I've been a pot of coffee girl. And here's a time lapse, absolutely exhilarating, of my coffee filling up. It's a beautiful thing to witness in nature, actually. So now I need to pick out my mug. Ooh, which mug am I gonna pick? Oh, I'm gonna pick this plain white one. I love this one. It's like the perfect size, and I use the, <laughs> speaking of the perfect size, I use this pumpkin spice latte creamer that is bigger than my head, and I gotta stir that up, stir up. and ooh, it's just so cozy and comfy in the fall time. Ooh, okay, ooh, it's hot. <laughs> so we're gonna walk off, Br brush your hair, girl, please, please. And I just relax with a, baseball game that is definitely not at night. It is not nighttime, as you can tell. And it's just so early in the morning that it's still dark. It is not nighttime, I'm telling you people. And I thought this shot of the shadow was kind of cool. Um, so it's time for a workout. Now this workout is very intense. It's not for the faint of heart. So I really have to prepare my mind and my body Perfect. to be put into this workout. It's a regimen. Here we go. I am not dancing to early 2000s music poorly. <laughs> so bad. It's intense, okay? It takes a lot of heart, a lot of grit, a lot of will. Now to wash all that sweat off, it's time for a shower. So I always have to pick the perfect playlist. This one's one of my favorites. It's songs from movie soundtracks. And this one's from Spider-Man. Amazing song, unironically. That's what I'm jamming out here too in the shower. And the music's really loud. It just echoes in this bathroom. Now I'm washing my face with the La Roche-Posay Furing Purifying Facial Cleanser. I'm very intense about it, as I can see. Then I use the seaweed glycolic acid toner. Um, I've been liking this. And then the snail mucin from TikTok. I was influenced by TikTok, and I actually love this stuff. I love it. Don't know what it does, but I love it. Then I use the rich hydrating cream from Cetaphil. And I just love this. It's like a ritual for me. It's so relaxing and fun. Even though it's morning. It's morning time. It's not night time. So we need to wake up, wake up, girl. And it's just a good time, <laughs> as, as you can tell from the thumbs up. So here we go. Let's go to the next thing. Come on. Like, I'm not gonna wait forever. Just walk on out of the bathroom. <gasps> Thank you for finally showing up. I was waiting on you. Um, so now we're getting into the real GRWM. Get ready with me. I'm just doing my typical makeup that I always do, so I won't get too into that. Just foundation, concealer. But I am adding a couple pieces of some 2014-esque makeup. I'm not gonna lie that and say that my makeup now isn't pretty much the same as it was in 2014, but we're gonna switch it up a little bit. <laughs> and um, I'm doing contour, the same contour I've been doing. Actually, just recently, I took some tips from one of those TikTok filters. We are being influenced. The influencer is being influenced. I don't call myself an influencer, but I guess I am in a way, but um, I'm just doing some basic eyeshadow because in a lot of the 2014 videos they just did very basic eyeshadow just like a matte color and a little bit under the eye and I wanted to add a little bit of shimmer on the inner corner and under the brow that seems to be very 2014 like very shimmery inner corner and then some liquid liner oh I 
I've done it a few times, but I'm still not amazing at it. And this liquid liner, girlies, it did not want to dry. I'll tell you that right now. It was migrating all over my face. It was moving and grooving, just like me. And then some mascara. Beautiful. But that eyeliner, girlies, I don't know what was happening there. Okay. And I need something for the lips. My fishy's just chilling over there. And I found this pink Kylie lipstick that I never wear, but it's kind of cute. I'm kind of living for it, actually, as I was saying. Kind of lovely and beautiful. Feeling it. Now I need to go fix this hair. Ooh. What better way to pay homage to 2014 than curling my hair? This was the funniest thing to me. How my hair just did this. I thought it was just top-notch comedy. So I'm curling my hair. This, sometimes my hair will curl and it cooperates, but sometimes it doesn't. I feel like that's a normal occurrence. Uh, just sometimes your hair's just not feeling it. And this day my hair was just not really feeling it, but that's okay. It was kind of like loose, wavy, uh, like whatever. And the makeup just all over <laughs> my eye. And last, to bring it all together, a 2014 fit check. I had stuff in my closet that really worked like concerningly well for this. The flats, the skinny jeans, the top that I used for an H2R costume a couple years ago that I kept. I feel like I kind of am giving Tori from Victorious and Zoe the Uni. Well, thanks for watching. That took literally all day. If we're being completely transparent here, that took all day. So it was my day routine. I'm gonna, and this makeup, I don't know. Liquid liner just wants to migrate right here and up here. We might have to cut to some silly goofy bloopers. Trying to get a camera. Slurp. Oh. Oh.